GCSE Geography, River Discharge and Flooding. Discharge is the volume of river water flowing per second, measured in cumex. This is a hydrograph. You need to know different aspects of a hydrograph, such as the peak discharge. This is the highest discharge in the period of time you're looking at, the most rain. Lag time the delay between the peak rainfall and the peak discharge, rising limb, the increase in river discharge as rainwater flows into the river, and falling limb, the decrease in river discharge as the river returns to its normal. Physical versus human factors that affect flood risk. One is heavy rainfall. This means that water arrives too quickly to infiltrate into the soil, so there's a lot of surface runoff, which increases discharge. Geology. Clay soils and some rocks, for example granite, shale, are impermeable, so runoff is increased. Prolonged rainfall. This can saturate the soil, and any further rainfall can't infiltrate, increasing runoff into river channels. Relief. If a river is in a steep-sided valley, water will reach a river channel much quicker because it can flow faster. Land use. Buildings are often made from impermeable materials, which increase surface runoff rather than absorbing water. Trees intercept rainwater on their leaves, which then evaporate. However, deforestation leads to more flooding. Can you decide which of these are physical and which of these are human? Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, be sure to subscribe and for more advice, follow the Instagram at noble for gcse For videos on GCSE English, Geography, Religious Studies and RS, make sure you subscribe now. See you soon.